excuse you. Oh. Oh. My gosh. What's going on everyone? Welcome to episode 54 of Skyrim. My first time playing through this game. I hope you're having an amazing day right now. And I'm so excited to get back into it. Just like always, we are about to have a peace council meeting with everybody. And if you missed the previous episode of everything that happened, I always try to put it up in the top corner there. And we also have the Skyrim playlist as well. And I want to give a super quick shout out to my awesome friend, Rob Booth, who is a YouTube Spud Squad member here and is an amazing awesome person and they gifted me my first ever displate and this is the Skyrim map so I'm so excited to hang this up so thank you so so much to Rob I just wanted to show this off because I think it's so cool I haven't even taken it out of the wrapping yet um, because I want to wait to hang it up but I just wanted to show that off because I think that's just like amazing so thank you so so much Rob and that website is dangerous I found a few other cool ones that I put on my wish list because I was like you know don't need them but it would be cool to have them on my uh, game room wall you know so some Elden Ring ones as well and another Skyrim one too but that one is so awesome so thank you so so much Rob okay let's do this you know why we're here. Delphine is here you are, or not. you are not invited here you are not welcome here we have as much right to be at this council as all of you. More, actually, since we were the ones that put the Dragonborn on this path. Were you? Hubris of the Blades truly knows no bounds. Delphine, we're not here to rehearse your grudges. The matter at hand is urgent. All drop oh. must be stopped. You wouldn't have called this council if you didn't agree. We know a great deal about the situation and the threat that all of it poses to us all. You need us here if you want this council to succeed. Uh, very well. You may enter. Okay. Hello, friends. Ooh. Ooh, we haven't been in this part of this building. Has this always been here? Hello, friends. Hello, hello. Hello, Jarl Bulgruf. General Tullius. Xena. Jarl Elisif. El Elisif? Legate. Yep. Why do you let <laughs> Please, take your seat so that we can begin. Let's do it. Now that everyone is here, please take your seats so we can begin. Sit down. I hope that we have all come no. here in the spirit you of... insult us by bringing her to this negotiation? Your chief Talos hunter? That didn't take long. Diplomat. Here, here. I have every right to be at this negotiation. I need to ensure that nothing is agreed to here that violates the terms of the White Gold Concordat. She's part of the Imperial delegation. You can't dictate who I bring to this council. Please, if we have to negotiate the terms of the negotiation, we will never get anywhere. Perhaps this would be a good time to get the Dragonborn's input on this matter. Me? By Izmir's being um. the nerve of those Imperial bastards, eh? To think that I would sit down at the same table with that. Thou more bitch, either she walks or I do. Dang! I don't know what to decide. This is too uh, conflicting. What's the harm? Besides, Tullius doesn't really want her here either. Maybe so, but bringing her here is a deliberate provocation. Tullius needs to know I won't be pushed around. Jeez. Let Tullius have his way on this. He'll have to give ground later. Mm. It feels like a mistake to me. But I'll bow to your judgment on this. But she is to observe nothing more. We are not negotiating with her. Is that clear? Elfric, why so hostile? After all, it's not the Thalmor that's burning your farms and killing your sons. She's supposed to be on our side? No, exactly. No. Not this time. Now that that's settled, may we proceed? Uh, did I make a mistake? I don't I know. I have something to say first. Here we go. The only reason I agreed to attend this council 
was to deal with the dragon menace. There's nothing else to talk about. Unless the Empire is finally ready to renounce its unjust claim to rule over the free people of Skyrim. I knew he wouldn't be able to resist. To a temporary truce to allow the Dragonborn here to deal with the dragons, nothing more. I consider even talking to the Empire a generous gesture. Are you done? Did you just come here to make speeches, or can we get down to business? Yes, let's get this over with. Are we ready he to proceed? is a chatty person, that's for sure. <laughs> Jarl Ulfric, General Tullius, this council is unprecedented. We are gathered here at the Dragonborn's request. I ask that you all respect the spirit of High Hrothgar. And do your best to begin the process of achieving a lasting peace in Skyrim. Who would like to open the negotiations? Yes, let's get down to it. We want control of Markar. That's our price for agreeing to a truce. So that's why you're here, Ulfric? You dare to insult the Greybeards by using this council to advance your own position? Jarl Elisif. General, this is outrageous. You can't be taking this demand seriously. I thought we were here to discuss a truce. Elisif, I said I'd handle it. Ulfric. You can't seriously expect us to give up Markarth at the negotiating table. You hope to gain in council what you've been unable to take in battle, is that it? I'm sure Jarl Ulfric does not expect something for nothing. Yes, that'd be entirely out of character. What in return? Wait, General, you don't intend to just hand over Markarth to that traitor? This is how the Empire repays us for our loyalty? Enough. First, let's be clear. This council wasn't my idea. I think it's a waste of time. You are a traitor to the Empire, and deserve a traitor's death. But I at least will negotiate in good faith. Since we're all here at your request, I'd like to hear what you think, Mark Hart. I don't like, like this. Dawnstar? Dawnstar is literally so tiny. How about Riften? I don't even remember where the heck Riften is. In exchange for Markarth, the source of most of Skyrim silver. Hardly. Riften seems like a better choice to me. Well fortified, easily resupplied from across Lake Honric. Plus all the mead we can drink. You're right, Riften is I'm fair. I'm glad you agree. I was starting to wonder whose side you were on here. I don't know whose side I'm on. You heard what she said, Alfred. Oh. We've made you a fair offer. They leave Are you serious about these talks, or are you just here to posture? I expected better from you, Dragon. Oh my gosh. I came here in good faith. And now it seems you held the Empire at every turn. As uh. for you, General Tullius, I see now that Garmar was right. Talking to the Empire is just as useless as ever. If you think you can hold Markar, you're as deluded as your Emperor when he signed away our freedom to Mathalmor. Skyrim will never again bow to your false empire. Let's go, Galmar. I should have listened to you in the first place. You always were a fool, Ulfric. You're no better at diplomacy than you are in the battlefield. Stop! Are you so blind to our danger that you can't see past your pity disagreement? Here you sit arguing about nothing. Why the fate of the land hangs in the balance. Is he with you, Delphi? If so, I advise you to tell him to watch his tongue. He is with me. And I advise you both to listen to what he has to say before you do anything rash. Don't you understand the danger? Don't you understand what the return of the dragons means? Alduin has returned, the world eater. Even now, he devours the souls of your fallen comrades. He grows more powerful with every soldier slain in your pointless war. Can you not put aside your hatred for even one moment in the face of this mortal danger? A very pretty speech. But what does Shut it have up. to do with the... If he's right about Alfred, we both have just as much to lose here, Tullius. Remember that. Now, back to the matter at hand. Don't hand me a mug of sheep's piss and call it me. These terms are still not acceptable. I'm sure you have something in mind. Damn right we do. 
You surrender Falkreath to us. Sidgir steps down, and Dangir of Stun resumes the Yalshin. Where do these demands stop, Ulfric? Do you expect me to surrender all of Skyrim? It seems I have no choice but to let the Dragonborn decide. Although I'm starting to doubt your fairness. Oh my gosh. What say you, Dragonborn? I don't know. There's too many things to remember. I was just wandering around fighting dragons and just like doing my own thing and now I've got to decide politics? I, you know, I feel like sometimes when you do side quests, I don't know. I just haven't been able to keep all of these stories in line. And I only get to play like once a week too, so it's hard to like remember everything, but it's like... Didn't Ulfric kill this other lady's husband or something like the high king i don't know and i don't know why they're so mad at the lady i i did sneak into their place didn't i and uh i stole some stuff for delphine there's just so many like webs of stuff so i'm gonna try my best i mean sure spoken like a true daughter of skyrim yep I suppose that's the fairest deal we're likely to get. It seems we may have an agreement. Jarl Ulfric, General Tullius, these are the terms currently on the table. Markarth will be handed over to Ulfric's forces, Jarl Edmund will step down, and Thangvor Silverblood will become the Jarl of Markarth. The Stormcloaks will withdraw from the Rift, allowing Imperial troops unhindered access. Jarl Leila Lawgiver will step down, and Maven Blackbriar will become the Jarl of Riften. Dang. Falkreath will be turned over to Ulfric, and Dengir of Stoon will return as Jarl. So much stuff. You both agree to this? The sons of Skyrim will live up to their agreements, as long as the Imperials hold to their. What about you, Alistair? Are these terms to your liking? Speak up! I'm sure General Tullius is waiting to do your bidding. I have nothing to say to that murderer. Yeah. General, you've proven yourself a good friend to Skyrim. I continue to trust that you will do your utmost to safeguard our interests. Thank you, Jarl Ellison. I appreciate your loyalty. The Empire can live with these terms, yes, for a temporary truce, until the Dragon Menace is dealt with. After that, Ulfric, there will be a reckoning. Count on it. Come on, Delmar. We have a lot of work to do. Giving up Markarth is a heavy price for this truce, Dragonborn. I hope it was worth it. Jarl Thalgruf, I assume you are familiar with the Dragonborn's plan. Yes, I'm ready to do my part. Just say the word, and my men will help you spring this trap. But the difficulty remains, how to lure a dragon to Dragon's Reach at all? Well, I'll stand outside and wave my arms. Question. You haven't overlooked that little detail, have you? Ah, I believe I can be of help here. I anticipated the problem. While you were arranging this meeting, was busy in the library of Skyhaven Temple. An unguessed trove of lost lore. But the important thing is that the blades recorded many of the names of dragons they slew. Cross-referencing this with Delphine's map of dragon burial sites, I believe I've identified one of the dragons that Old Man has raised up. How does that help us? Ah, don't you see? The names of dragons are always three words of power shouts hmm. by calling the dragon with his voice he will hear you wherever he might be why would he come when called he's not compelled to but dragons are prideful by nature and loath to refuse a challenge your voice in particular is likely to intrigue this dragon after your victory over Aldrin, i think it's very likely that he will be unable to resist investigating your call so what's this dragon's name? Ah, indeed. I'm no master of the voice, like these worthy gentlemen. But it is written here, in this scroll. Ooh, another scroll. Oda Vin. Oda Winged Vin. Snow Hunter, as I read it. I hope this truth gives you what you need. Dang. The 
there's one more thing we know about. One second, Delphine, everything's happening. <laughs> oh, Delphine. Um. You know what? Parthenax, the dragon that the Greybeards have been protecting for all these years. He needs to die. He deserves no. to die. And it falls to you to kill him. Why? Until he's dead. Well, I'm sorry, but we would dishonor our oaths as blades if we continue to help you. What? About Parthenax? Make your choice, Dragonborn. You're either with us or against us. Why does he need to die? Here's the big picture. He helped Alduin enslave our ancestors. He may have betrayed Alduin in the end, but that makes no. him worse, not better. Oh, uh... We can't afford to give Parthenax the opportunity to betray us in turn and return to his old master. <sighs> what do you have against the Greybeards? If they had their way. You do nothing but sit up on their mouth. Yeah, you've already said the that. Greybeards are so afraid of power. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the no, and they're afraid of you. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septim. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? Dang. Yeah, I'm ready to take this tankard and drink my sorrows away. No, but for real, like, dang. That's a lot of decisions that just happened. And I love Parthenax. He helped me. Why would I kill him? Why do we always have to decide between two things? Why can't we all just get along, you know? Well, oops, that's not what I meant to do, but I guess we might as well do it. Oh, lordy. Let's increase my... They have the meeting with this. <laughs> with this beautiful face. Ah, <sighs> well then. Wow. Prepare a trap. Oh man. Get me out of this place with all these decisions that we have to make. I'm ready to go like, kill some things. <laughs> Jeez. Ooh, yeah, Hermaeus Mora. Let's do another Daedric quest. Well, technically, I guess we have one. I'm telling you, sometimes it is really hard to remember all the things. All right, let's see what we need to do for this, I guess. Oh. We're ready, Dragonborn. Just say the word. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Are you ready to spring the trap on the dragon? As I promised. My men stand ready. The great chains are oiled. We wait on your word. I'm ready. Let's go trap my a dragon. I know what to do. Make sure you do your part. I'm putting my city in your hands. Okay, let's make sure I have all the shouts I need, I guess. Call dragon. Oh, Raving, hear my voice and come forth. I summon you in my time of need. Oh, Lord. Chanting increased to 55. I just randomly decided to enchant that glass thing. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing <sighs> All right. The of the great warriors. Let's go outside, I guess, and see what the heck we gotta do. going to be interesting. I'm assuming that's where this is going to go. Alright. But am I ready? Okie dokie, do I have the shout? Oh. Call a dragon. We're ready when you are. Oh! Go 
ahead and call this. I did. We're ready. Oh, snap. My gosh. land there oh fudge <laughs> oh I'm not even doing any damage to him what's going on holy crap What's happening? Ryan, lady? What is happening right now? Why isn't his health even showing up, though? What's going on? He's so cool. Dang. Well, maybe I shouldn't do, you know... <laughs> this one. Maybe I should do this! Ice! Do do do. Dang it, what? Why isn't his stuff showing up? Guys, I'm so confused. He resisted the ice form. Dang it. Whoa! Oh, I'm an idiot. That's why his health is showing up. <laughs> Guys, I'm a freaking dingus, but that's okay. Oh, caught like a bear in a trap. Oh, he's so beautiful. I feel bad. Ah, I forget. You do not have the Dova speech. My eagerness to meet you in battle was my undoing, Dova Keen. I so salute your mm, low cunning in devising such a Gramin Dol stratagem. Rubonar, you went to a great deal of trouble to put me in this humiliating position. Sir <sighs> Alduin, hmm? No doubt you want to know where to find Alduin. Yes. That's right. Where is he hiding? Renik Vaza. An apt phrase. Alduin Boval. One reason I came to your call was to test your thorn for myself. I was being an idiot. <laughs> Many of us have begun to question oh. Alduin's lordship. Whether his thorn was truly the strongest. Among ourselves, of course, Muni Mae, none were yet ready to openly what? defy him. You were telling me where to find Alduin? Once Lord Croesus, 
innumerable pardons, I digress. He has traveled to Sovngarde to regain his strength, devouring the Silesure, the souls of the mortal dead, a privilege he jealously guards. His door to Sovngarde is at Skuldafin, one of his ancient fanes high in the eastern mountains. Minduran pa ok avarantil. I surely do not need to warn you that all his remaining strength is marshaled there. Zulost ofan hinlan. Now that I have answered your question, you will allow me to go free? So many decisions. Do you promise to serve me? Or not until Alduin is defeated? Whatever. Um, serve you? No. Need id. If and when you defeat Alduin, when you stay in this I trap. Will reconsider. Hmm, Krosis. There is one detail about Skaldafen I neglected to mention. Tell me what you know then. Only this. You have the Thurm of Adova, but without the wings of one, you will never set foot in Skaldafen. Uh, uh. Of course, I could fly you there, but not while imprisoned like this. <gasps> Guys, I want to fly on a freaking dragon. Do you expect me to take your word for that? Aran, you wound me, Dovahkiin. I may not tell the whole truth, but I am no liar. Go and see for yourself. Zu ni bo nor het. I will be here, unless Alduin returns before you do. Dang. You have reconsidered my offer, hmm? Onikankron? You will release me, Roland, if in return I promise to take you to Skaldafen and stop helping Alduin? I'm still wondering if I can trust you. It was you that lured me here and took me prisoner. Vobalan Gramidol, I have done nothing to earn your distrust. True. You did try to trick me into letting you go. In our Orenu. And yet here I am, still your prisoner. Incredible. Uh... Sir, you have no idea how long I have waited for such an opportunity. I would be most appreciative if you would permit me to perform some, uh, tests on you. Purely in the interests of the advancement of knowledge. So, are you acting serious? Mage, do not test my promise to the Dovahkiin. I assure you, you will not even notice me. Most of them are hardly painful at all to a large dragon such as yourself. Very bad idea, even for you. Surely you wouldn't miss a few scales, or a small amount of blood. Jume, what are you doing back there? <laughs> Dang. Don't be a weirdo, dude. I'll set this dragon free right now. Where'd he even go? Oh, okay, he's leaving. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, the captured dragon, Odaving, has revealed that Alduin has escaped to Sovngarde, the Nord underworld, where he feeds on the souls of the dead. His portal to Sovngarde is located in the ancient dragon temple of Suldafin, high in the Yaral Mountains. The only way to reach it 
It's a set out of being free so he can fly me there. Dang. Oh my goodness, guys. So many decisions. <sighs> guys, I uh, really want to ride a dragon. So we're going to do it. You have reconsidered yes, my... Yes, yes. You will release me, Roland. Yes, I'll set you free if, if you promise to take return, me to Sol... I promise Sol to take... Skuldafin. Korov Gain Mirad. It is wise to recognize when you only I'm have nervous. one choice. And you can trust me. Zuni Tarudis. Alduin has proven himself unworthy to rule. I go my own way now. Free me, and I will carry you to Skaldafin. Yes. Let me see here. How do I do that? Still amazed that your plan worked. He's so excited. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city to keep. Okay. Then go do that. Yes, Sarah. I've got my eyes on you. Well, you should, because I'm going to try to set this freaking thing free. How do I do that? Need something. I think my headphones are going bad. <laughs> My headphones keep making a little clicking sound. How do I set them free? Oh. <laughs> Sometimes I, uh, I'm a dingus. It's happened quite a few times in this episode, though. I something to tell the grand kid. You sure about that? Open the you trap. Have to let that dragon loose after all the trouble to catch him in there. Yes, I'm sure. Off funeral. Someone else is going to have to help you get him back in there again. Get ready to open the trap. This seems like a really bad idea to me. Carry on, so. This is all part of the Dragonborn's plan. All the gods. Was new. We need Dain Ruthie Aswan. Uth, I await your command as promised. Are you ready to see the world as only a Dova can? <sighs> I'm ready. Take me to Skuldafin. So, Brit of I warn you, once you've flown the skies of Kaisal, your envy of the Dov will only increase. Amativ. Oh, snap! So cool! We rode on a dragon. This is as far as I can take you. Grief both Akrin. I will look for your return. All Alduin's. Dang. Where am I? Dang. Reach Alduin's portal. Okay. Alright, we deep in it now. No friends this time. Dang it, he moved. Oh, oh noise. So cool. It's 
Jeez. What? Oh my gosh! What? It's a random dragon? Why am I like so slow? Do you take my stamina? What did I just do? What is happening right now? Do I not have any... get to use any of those I guess now bro what am I supposed to do here this dragon down? I have this one still, right? Dude, I swear these were gone. You couldn't even see that I was like... Resisting the ice form. What's the point of it? Do, 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 do. Oh. This is just like speed through it. This sucks. Just freaking die. I think I'm just supposed to keep going. I don't know. Oh, 
I don't know if I'm ready for this. My gosh, finally get my freaking shout to work. And then that happens, seriously. Am I supposed to run for it? Oh. No way I'm ready for this. Oh. Hiding, dude. <laughs> so I feel like this is a uh, the test of like whether you are high enough level or something. Oh, jeezy Pete's okay. Why is my freaking shout working? Dang. Okay. <sighs> Got a freaking Draugr right in my butt too. Freaking run! <sighs> Why can't I jump? Go, 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 go. <laughs> you know there's more enemies in here probably, right? My gosh, I'm sweating. I'm just like wasting all of my stuff right now probably. I know it already quick saved for me, but we're gonna go ahead and quick save. My goodness. I mean, what level did you guys do this? I'm level 28 right now. I feel like that's probably not enough. But dang. This is crazy. I should have figured it was going too quick. I'm like, man, I feel like we're getting close to the end here. Oh, there's nothing secret back here. At least there's less likely to be dragons in here, right? How am I expecting myself to defeat Alduin if I can't even... Oh, hello, sir. Where are you going? Trying to do a sneak attack, isn't that what I'm doing right now? Great. These guys are tough. Why 
Why is my heavy armor increasing? What? Get my magicka, let's go. Finish that guy for real? Nice. Jeez. They barely have like anything. <laughs> So like what? Oh, is it my helmet that's like, I guess the heavy armor? Okay. Well, I made it farther than I thought I was going to. Yeah, detected no crap. <laughs> um, you can come get me or what? Hello? Thing. Oh, it's too quiet in here. It's so quiet and awkward. What's wrong with this one? I keep missing him, I think. It's taking him so long to die, sheesh. Nice. How many freaking guys are here? Same area. Oh, I see a trap. Okay. Feels weird. Not having Fandal or Barbus. Maybe that's why it's too quiet. I don't have any barking happening in my ears. Quick save. <laughs> oh lord, oh lord, oh lord, stop sneaking, stop sneaking. They got me that time. How did how is it shooting that far away? Oops. Dang it, I keep messing. Me and press a different button. Okay, that guy is way tougher. Dude! That's it? Jeez! Get me out of there! Shh. 
Jeez. <sighs> That's all you had on you? They're so tough. Are they much tougher or is it because I've always had someone help me? You guys can be honest. Which one is it? I have to like lure. Did I? Oh, there's two of them. Whoopsies. Not see the second one. Um. I know it's definitely easier when you have someone with you. Another one? Oh! Hello. Oh! <laughs> stop sneaking, stop sneaking! Oh! What? Where'd he go? Hi. Hey, I'm capturing all the souls. Okay, quick save. I am on high alert. Okay, are you the last one? Stop sneaking. No, there's two more. Caramba, this is stressful. <sighs> okay. I took care of all those guys, right? You know, I haven't had to pick lock anything in a long time. It makes me sad. I miss it. I'm scared I'm gonna get kind of deep into this and then be like, okay, I'm not ready. <laughs> so it's like, if I'm not ready, I should probably do that now, right? Decide now. Make that a snake. Did I search this guy yet? Okay. <sighs> snake. Don't see a symbol here. I see a whale here. I see symbols up there. So I guess this one, that's not, okay. Snake Eagle. Okay. Snake Eagle. Snake Whale. Right? But there's only four symbols. Four symbols, but only three of these. Well, we got Whale. Snake. That work. No. <laughs> we 
Make sure this one is whale. Whale snake eagle. Hmm. Eagle, snake, eagle. <laughs> Dang, I'm not sure about this one. Hmm. I don't see another clue anywhere. do anything with these, can I? No. Okay, there's gotta be something on this pillar or something that I'm missing, maybe? OMG. Snake. Whale, okay. So is this one, okay, I'm just gonna try that. I mean, this one already had snake there too, so maybe this one needs to be eagle? we go. Eagle opens that one and then maybe snake opens the other one. There we go. Finally, dang. That one took me way longer than I was expecting. Okay. Let's quick save. Oh. Let's not search the empty thingy. Oh boy. Even more droggers. Oh. Oh lord, and of course it's like a tough one. Why is this ice spike so uh powerful? Frost rune. Okay. Mm I miss having a friend with me. Oh, you know what I need? Oops. Oh lord, how many of them now? Let me get the sanguine rose out as well. I feel like there's one on the right side of me. Yup. start using unrelenting force again, you know? Fudge, sorry, dude. Oh! Nice job, buddy. Oh, I forgot about the. You guys were all telling me about that, and I totally forgot again. Telling me about how I can't conjure Flame Atronach and my buddy here. Totally forgot. No one ended up coming out of that one. 
How do you know which one they're going to come out of? Oh boy. I want to try the chain lightning again. Dang. What a shot there. Leave me, buddy. I'm all alone now. Alright, let's go get him. my friend. Did he get him? Dang. Okay, he gone. Now we'll just leave it like this for now, I guess. I'm like barely breathing, very focused, so I'm so I'm sorry guys. making noise. My gosh. Sorry, I'm so into this right now. Let's go, but first let's get some gold. Let's go. them all before he goes away like that. <laughs> okay, even more maps now. So we have the eagle, whale, Oh, what? Oh. 
fucking hell, you're just ye I'm yeeting these things. Sheesh! And they're damaging me at the same time, which is not great, but... Eagle. Okay. I kind of want to close this door. <laughs> you know, just because I don't want anyone to attack me. This one. Hmm. Ooh, I almost missed this. And this is a snake. This one should be snake. Should be. Let's go see. If you made it to this part of the video, the secret magic word will be snake. Activate the leather. Leather? Lever. Oops. Sheesh, just clicked like 10 things. <sighs> okay, we're at the temple. Let's open it up. Oh, just waiting for me right there. Bunch of them in here right now. <sighs> he says, There you are, weakling. Don't die before you get there for me. Oh, he died. Or fell? I don't know what the heck happened there. <gasps> what the? Why don't I have enough magicka? What the? Did I miss him? Lightning's throwing me off. I keep thinking something's wrong with the game. Like it's uh lagging really bad or something. Let me go collect my three pieces of gold. Thank you very much. Oh, what did it say? Says this bow is better. What do I have? I always forget to check this. Dang, okay. Never noticed that. But it's only two more damage ish. Okay, um. 
think I got everybody. Definitely hear them in there. Get my friend out. Where are they? Up there, maybe? I see the oil you guys told me about, like, very, very early on. If I just set flame to that, it'll just, like, make the whole place catch on fire. Quick saving like a fiend. Come on. Come on, Magica. Jeez. My goodness. I'm sorry, dude. I think I killed him, too. Jeez. Guys, I'm really sorry I'm like so focused and not talking very much. <sighs> All right, just pull the lever. Quick save. I always like walk on the edges of these things. I don't trust it. <laughs> oh. Dang, I was going to try to like deploy it or whatever. Not like that though. Reanimate a weak body to fight for you. I wanted to shoot that thing and have them come attack me. My goodness, how much further is this? Dang, I think I missed him. Rose, here we go. Yes, so we're gonna need this probably. Dang. Okay. Nice job, buddy. We gotta watch. Whoops, not that. I gotta watch my weight because uh, I don't have anybody to carry it for me this time. I'm not alone. There's no one here beside me. Ooh, this one has a dragon on it. I love it. Thank you so much for being here right now, guys. Okay. Oh, I was just trying to zoom in. Fox Moth Dragon. Nice. Diamond claw. I love these claws. They're so cool. Oh, snap. 
Bye, friend. Have you ever seen me save so much ever? Okay, we've got a while to go. It looks like we've made it through all of that. I'm pretty freaking proud. Um, I should have known it was going to be pretty intense, but didn't think it was going to be this intense, I guess. But man, we're trying to reach Alduin's portal to Sovngarde. Did I make a mistake going all the way in here? Probably. But we're going to finish this in the next episode because, man, there is so much going on. Um, thank you so, so much for making all the way to the end of the video. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. A big, big thank you to my YouTube Spud Squad, my YouTube members, and my Ko-Fi members. You guys are amazing. Thank you for your extra support and supporting me and the channel. And thank you everyone for still being here. If you've been here all the way since the beginning of the channel, like starting up, or if you've been here since the beginning of Skyrim or any of the videos, thank you guys so much. It is much appreciated. The magic word for this video to put in your comment to show that you made it all the way until the end of the video will be lightning or an emoji of a lightning since we were kind of using that lightning spell um and yeah thank you so so much i hope i see you in the next episode make sure to subscribe like and comment do all the youtube things to help with the algorithm um and i appreciate you so much have an amazing rest of your night see you on the next one bye